In this video, I am going to explain you about the conditions in the raid. Uh, please make sure this is condition means at the checkout. If condition has been true, the raid will be appear. If condition false, the raid will not appear. You can add multiple conditions at once time in the raid. Uh, we have sub options with the conditions uh, like if you select all then the multiple condition must be satisfied. If you choose any then any of these three condition will be satisfied. If you choose not all then it will be must none of the condition will be satisfied and this rate will be displayed. So here uh, let me first explain you about the conditions like uh, if you want to set condition based on the card like it, it is a quantity so any items in the card or any type or tag just find the conditions like less than 5 means card quantity uh, must be less than 5 this rate will be available if card has 6 item then it will this rate will not appear let me first explain you about this all the condition then we will learn by the example so quantity means cart real item quantity like even if one line item and five quantity then it works if uh, two line items with some two one line item has two quantity third line item has four quantity it works count total quantity total means the price of the cart sell product total means the items which has a compare price in the Shopify higher than regular price then it will count only the products which are in the sell. Non-sell means the item which has no any sell and count as a regular products. Weight of the card total. Distance means the store origin location to the customer destination shipping address location. These options will only available if you are in the higher plan in the application. Address means if you do not want to ship on the PO box address like if you set like PO box then this rate will not appear if customer has entered the PO box. Day means when customer going to place an order. Time means when customer going to place an order after X hours. Per product quantity it works with mapping tool using the tag like uh, we have a tag tag uh, frozen and quantity greater than 5 so it count all products which has a tag frozen with quantity 5 same like the price total weight tag SKU vendor properties line item of the properties it will check per line item then we have option for customer we need to enter the identify the checkout customer first name or last name email phone number company city these things will be identify whatever inputted at the checkout here just one thing at checkout like we cannot identify the email of the customer but using the customer API whatever the input name by customer like first name and last name we will find that name using the customer API and if check the email is same as in the customer then we will send this rate otherwise not same like a tag. If customer has tag then we display the rate it works to use like a wholesale customer shipping rate the last option of delivery delivery is also integrated with the delivery date plan in the application here so day of week means if you want to set up the different shipping rate for the customer choose weekends like higher rates for weekends then you can set this day of week and the next option is day is like uh, 
if you want some higher rate for the customer who has chosen a same day. Zero means same. One is tomorrow. If you want additional shipping rate if customer choose uh, next day then this condition will help you. Date it used for specific date only. This works if you want for specific time promotion only like if you only give a free shipping on Saturday of this day then the shipping rates will only be visible. This is a delivery time in if customer choose a specific time slot and if this is slot map this time the shipping rate will appear. The final option is order type. This works like if you want to send a free shipping rate with name title of store pickup this option will be visible at checkout if customer selected store pickup on the cart page widget. Let's start with example. Here I have set up this is a flat rate of 10 rupees and I don't have any condition. Let me set a condition uh, address of checkout does not contain PO box. So if I use at this checkout it will not appear this shipping rate. You can change this error message at theme language in the Shopify admin. Here my condition has false. This means shipping rates appear. Let me add another condition. So this rate is only available for Saturday and Sunday. Today my day is not Saturday or Sunday then this rate will not appear. Let me create another example with per line item. Per product tag contains frozen. So any option means any of the item has a tag in the cart, uh, this rate should be appear. Let me add a product which has a tag frozen. So please make sure this is just appear because of the frozen tagged item in the cart. If I remove the frozen item in the cart, my shipping rate will not appear. So this is not for frozen product shipping rate, but this is the condition. If frozen item in the cart, my shipping rate appears. Same like this all product must satisfy this condition. That means I have two item in the cart. The, oh, both items must have tag frozen. If I choose none, then none of the item in the cart must not have any frozen tag. So I have reversed this condition, then rate should be appear. Okay. Let's test with some other condition like uh, tag. I have created a condition with tag equal to wholesale and set up a rate and I have another customer who have a tag. Here I have used the first name and last name searching if this customer has a tag then it will appear the shipping rate at checkout. If I change this thing like uh, different name. This will not find a tag and not display any shipping rate. Let's un understand another condition uh, which is according to delivery day. I have set these shipping rates for Monday to Friday. 
and this requires a delivery date widget of the application here I have said let me choose a Saturday and try to check out This shipping rates will only appear if I choose a proper day that is assigned by the conditions. See. Same we have other conditions that is a day that means this date will only appear if X day from today. This means help you to set up higher shipping rates for the same day. If you set a zero, this rate will only appear at the card page, customer choose same day. If customer do not choose the same day, this rate will not appear. Let me create you a shipping rates that is for pickup only. So if I choose store pickup and I set this price as a zero store pickup I have added a widget that is include a shipping and pickup both if I choose store pickup and check out my shipping rate only appear in this case I hope you got all the explanation about the conditions. Thank you.